Last year, nearly 15 miners became pregnant in Bicha Bay, a remote area in northwest Togo. On est venu pour causer entre nous. On a appris, tu es enceinte. On est venu pour voir aujourd'hui vraiment si c'était vrai. Oui, c'était vrai. This 15-year-old girl in year six is interviewed by a village committee responsible for investigating teenage pregnancies. The committee is set up to protect young girls so that their families do not abandon them and to make sure that the boyfriend's family does not abandon them financially either. The father and his family refuse to recognize the child. If the paternity is confirmed, the committee will try to convince the family to fulfill the financial obligation. They will have to deal with the pregnancy. Pregnant minors are often treated with contempt by the community. Although abortion is illegal in Turgo, except in cases of rape, some desperate teenagers risk dangerous backstreet termination. At some point, parents stopped putting their daughters in school for fear they would get pregnant. This is why we set up this support system within the village. This teen's family disowned her when she became pregnant. No longer able to pursue her dream of becoming a midwife, today she raises awareness among young people about sexual responsibilities. With the help of other girls and mothers, she discusses abstinence, condoms and the consequences of dropping out of school. In the case they get pregnant, they are told to go to the health centre for prenatal consultations and to continue their studies after the delivery. To try and break the taboo surrounding sex, young sexual health campaigners organise discussions and sometimes even hand out condoms at the market. At the hospital, we put down their names before giving out condoms. So young people are afraid to go there. They're ashamed. The Togolese government says that in 2021, schools reported more than 5,000 cases of unwanted pregnancies. These led to one in three girls dropping out of education in that year alone.